as the minister of the FCT makes For the sense. second time since his assumption of office, the Minister of the Federal Capital Territory, Mr. Yisomwiki, is flagging off the resurfacing and rehabilitation of roads project. Inside uh, here in the FCTA, one of us. The ceremony which took place at the popular AYA roundabout is expected to focus solely on remedial action on roads within Asokoro district. This second phase of the resurfacing project we cover a total of 49 roads in Asokoro, Wose, and Metama. As you are aware, roads in FCC were constructed many years ago, and some of them, due to extensive use, have become weak. In a unanimous voice, the National Assembly says it will provide the necessary support needed to improve infrastructure development and other areas in the nation's capital. We, members of the Senate Committee on FCD, are clearly following the foresight and initiative of the new FCT administration. The FCT minister, while reacting to some of the ongoing projects, appeals to citizens to desist from wrongful tag on the present administration. 2010, the federal government awarded the contract of the vice president residence. The federal government awarded not the Nibu's government in 2010. And this contract was awarded at the cost of 7 billion naira to Jelos Beggar. Now check 2010 and 2023, 13 good years, this project was abandoned. Now, a reasonable government comes to Seluk. Do we have you spent some money in this project? Do we abandon it? Wasting taxpayers' money? We have taken steps to say we must complete it. People should commend the administration and not to make statements, blackmailing and telling the public lies, teachers of lies, just like as they told that they won an election when they never won an election. After his speech, Mr. Wiki, in the company of the Minister of State, proceed to flag off the project. He is confident that by 2024, with the continued support of the legislature and residents, most ongoing projects in the FCT will be completed. From Abuja, Kumbi Abuluadi, Channels Television News.